Nearly a year after unarmed Stefan Clark was fatally shot by police, prosecutors on Saturday say they will not file criminal charges against two Sacramento police officers involved in the shooting. Was a crime committed? There's no question that human being died. But when we look at the facts and the law and we follow our ethical responsibilities, the answer to that question is no. 22-year-old Clark was gunned down by police on March 18th in his grandparents' backyard after police responded to a report of a person, which was later confirmed to be Clark, breaking car windows. Before he was killed, officers discovered Clark near his grandparents' home where he fled into the backyard. Prosecutors on Saturday said that Clark advanced on the officers despite being told to stop and was in a, quote, shooting stance with his arm extended during the incident. Police department, can you hear us? Police fired at Clark 20 times. An autopsy report later concluded that Clark was shot seven times. Police say the officers who shot Clark feared he was holding a firearm, but later found out he only had a cell phone. Why did you just shoot him in the arm, shoot him in the leg, send a dog, send a taser? Why? <laughs> I just want justice for my aggressor. Clark's death sparked protests and added fuel to a national debate on police force against unarmed black people. <laughs> Following Stefan's death, his brother protested at a city council meeting <laughs> and chanted during his brother's <laughs> funeral. Sacramento's district attorney on Saturday said she hoped that the community stay united following the decision.